In this video, we're going to talk about E911 error. E911 is nice and simple. It's not really an error at all. It just means that the water is moving far too slowly through the unit and it would like you to speed it up. And you can see it says E911 here and your power LED is flashing. So the first thing we need to do is clear this nice and easy. It says press OK to close. So if you press OK twice, it will disappear and we're now going to restart the unit. The most important thing is to wait for our pumps to start and you'll see our pump is now running. And if we look at our flow rate over here on our flow meter, we can see it's very, very low. In this case, it's less than eight liters a minute. That is not 20. But it's also possible to read this from the remote controller of the unit. So if you go to the controller, and you press the plus and the minus button at exactly the same time. If you press the up and down button for five seconds, you enter the service mode. In the service mode, if you go zero, two, zero, two, and then press OK. If you go to indoor zone option and then scroll down to indoor zone status information and press OK, you can see here your flow rate is 4.4 litres a minute. This is not enough, it needs to be 20. And in our case, it's nice and simple. All it is, is that this valve over here is closed. So if I open it, you'll see that the flow rate goes up enormously. And by the time we get back to the controller, in about 20 seconds time, the flow rate will increase and the E911 problem is solved. If your engineer can't get this to 20 litres a minute, then he needs to look at this. This is not a problem with the unit. 